Uh, Mark, thanks for joining us, mate. Obviously, your first North West Counties game yep, today. Yep. Uh, what's the mood like in the in the club yeah, after? My mood is very, very, very disappointed. We've had a good pre-season, uh, played against some good teams, and accounted itself a lot better than we have today. I'm not going to blame the pitch. I'm not going to blame the league or anything like that. I'm blaming my play, uh, players' performance. Uh, very below par. Not why. Not what I expect. Um, we just rolled over and didn't give anything at all. Give the ball away too much, uh, didn't compete. Um, a good organised side. Uh, obviously, I know a few people uh, who's associated, uh, Tony Sullivan, who obviously I used to play against, uh, but very, very disappointed. Even though they went down to 10, 10 men, we didn't really uh, capitalise on that. We didn't create anything. We give the ball away cheaply. They were quicker, brighter, and they were more competitive than we were. In the second half, you looked a lot more, the team looked a lot more energetic, a lot more up for it. What was said at half time to, to sort of change that? Um, they, know, they know how I am. I'm a very passionate uh, well, manager now. I was a passionate player, I still am a player. Um, if circumstances would have been different, obviously we had two injuries early and we had a, a striker on the bench. I'd have probably put myself on just to just to give an example of what I want and how I play the game in the right tempo. Uh, but it didn't work out. Um, but other than that, I've got a lot of decisions to make for Wednesday's game. Chadderton, another team unknown to me which the, the, the league is, um, but as I said to the players, it's a good thing because nobody knows us and we don't know them, so you don't know who you're playing, but the taster today will give them obviously an indication of what teams are like here. The very togetherness, uh, very competitive and they want to win. And I have the same mentality, but my boys today just didn't didn't uh, perform or turn up or give me that um, idea that they had the same mentality as Lower Brett. Before we come on to the Chatterton game, you had a couple of injuries today, especially your goalkeeper. Um, is there yeah, anything serious? We, we, fortunately, we, we have two good goalkeepers and it was a, a hard decision to make the decision who would actually play today. Um, so I, I did actually put um, a goalkeeper on the bench and, well, fortunately... It was the right move, but obviously losing a key goalkeeper as well um, restricted putting substitutes on, as I spoke about. Obviously, we spoke, as you said, Chad on Wednesday night. Is that a good thing for you to have a game as soon after yes, this I, one? Yes, I want a to reaction. That? I definitely want a reaction. Um, we will be in Monday. Um, I will uh, put them through the paces. Um, a lot of... Uh, Emily fans who came said that we didn't look fit. Now, I'm totally against that because we have done a lot of um, pre-season. I think obviously they've not adapted to the pitch. Obviously, Lower Breck were more intelligent, move the ball quicker, look sharper. We look sluggish. I uh, don't know the reason for that. Um, but we will be working on stuff Monday, ready for Wednesday, and I've told them there will be changes. Okay. Uh, the lads, I give them the opportunity to keep the shirts and what they've done to me in the dressing room is give the shirts back to me. So I need a, a vast improvement if we're going to stamp as authority on this on this league. Which with the players that we have drafted in, a lot, a lot of young young experienced players in uh, the North East counties should be able to adapt and play against any team. Well, best of luck for the season. Thank right, you for speaking to us. Yeah.